into your vibration a lay reading reading for um the the second week of may the week begins with the energy of the empress this is the week of the empress so it's a wonderful week for a lot of people so let's see what is going to be coming in in this week for you guys okay whatever that is going to be transpiring whatever situation or whatever that is going to be transpiring in this week it's going to be a very much positive energies that are going to be coming out okay so let's see what is happening for you guys you Aries in this week on Monday Aquarius I mean Aquarius you have your enemies okay so on Monday you have to deal with your enemies on Tuesday um, you have the energy of the two of Pentacles on Wednesday you have this energy of the Sun on Thursday you have the energy of the Emperor um, on Friday you have the energy of the Queen of Wands um, Saturday you have the Queen of Cups and on Sunday you have the energy of the eye princess in reverse okay so let's go ahead and look at what is happening for you guys in this week what is happening is that some of you your enemies are trying to block your emotion or your financial situation and your enemy and the person who is trying to block this is the Queen of Wands. Okay, the Queen of Wands can be an Aries, a Leo, or a Sagittarius. Okay, and this person is is not a very nice person. This person is to, is your enemy. Okay, they're trying to block your financial situation and your emotion. Okay, be aware of this in the beginning of the week that you have to deal with someone who is an Aries, a Leo, or a Sagittarius. Be aware of this in the beginning of the week. As we look in the middle of the week, you have a, a situation that is going to be coming out very positive for you. Um, there is a new opening. Um, there is something good that is about to happen. Okay, and um, um, who is going to help you is someone who is um, um, Pisces, Cancer, or a Scorpion. Um, this man is going to help you. Um, to to move away whatever that uh, person who is an um, Aries Leo or uh, of Sagittarius this person is over the age of 45 that woman but this man over the age of 45 is going to be coming in and is going to be removing the block that this person has set this man is going to be coming in and removing the block that this person have set then at the end of the week this is going to be good for a lot of you if you um, were looking for work or um, if you have been in the situation where you were um, trying to um, change your financial situation or with work this is going to be extremely good um, if your father is an Aries Leo or Sagittarius and is sick he's going to there's good news that is coming for him um, in this week whatever is happening um, your intuition is blocked you're not seeing things clearly so you need to be aware of this and need to know and understand what is happening okay but um, at the end of the week if you guys were looking for work um, this is going to be coming out okay this is going to be good so um, this is um, very very positive this is extremely positive so what we're going to do we're going to look for more information to see what exactly is happening so what is happening with the moon because the moon this moon is your enemy but she can't reach you it's as if um, there is a protection it's as if um, there is a spiritual protection so let's see what is happening with the moon and the two of Pentacles for you guys um, it has to do with the lovers it has to do with connection with the lovers the energy of the moon and the Pentacles and um, for the people who are connected to the fish purse uh, for with a, uh, um, a Pisces um, it's as if a, somebody who is a cancer or and um, someone who is a cancer or a um, Aries Leo or a Sagittarius woman is trying to block you so people who are connected with and Pisces 
um, there's someone who is a cancer who is trying to break the relationship up so be aware of this okay for some of you um, 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 someone who is a cancer is uh, yeah a cancer is trying um, to block your emotions or um, to stop your money but you know he can't he or she can't it's all about um, you and your partner is as if there is someone that is trying um, to block uh, you and your partner okay someone so be aware of this this can be a cancer who is trying to block you and your partner and the relationship between you and your partner be careful now there is a situation that has to do with the Queen of Wands. What does this have to do with the Queen of Wands? This Queen of Wands is all about money. Page of Coins. Um, this Queen of Wands is all about money. She's she, she is looking for money from you and your partner. This could be your mom your mom she could be an Aries a Leo or a Sagittarius because this is a woman over the age of uh, um, 45 and it's all about money for her you know it's all about money she wants money from um, you know you and your husband or you and your partner it's all about money she's a greedy greedy person okay whoever this person is is very greedy and she tried to do something but you're going to find out about this this is a greedy person let's see what is happening with her and this um, king of cups her and this king of cups she's trying to um, you know it's as if and this is this is really someone who is a nest a piece of work okay um, apparently she's trying to work against you with this with a king of cups with someone of an of, of an older age but this man is smart this man is seeing the truth of a situation this man is looking away from her because this man doesn't believe a word she is saying this man do not like her this man is thinking I am seeing who you are and trust me you can do anything I'm not doing anything to help you so it's as if this this woman whoever she is is over the age of 40 and is an Aquarius um, she's an Aquarius no she's an Aries a Leo or a Sagittarius and she is asking this man and she wants to work with this man to bring you down but that shit ain't gonna happen I'm sorry because this man is looking away from her and thinking oh god woman um, you know it's not happening okay so that is good okay as we move forward we're seeing the energy of the two of Pentacles and the Sun is coming out so what is happening with this um, the number two is going to be your energy vibration you um, Aquarians are going to be working with duality in this week the number two seems to be because you have it's balancing out your emotion but in a sense you're bringing your financial situation in balance also and you're balancing out your emotion and bringing um, the um, financial situation in balance and this is going to be good oh my god I don't know who you are out there and your mom or whoever that person is um, is an Aries Leo or Sagittarius but God I don't know turn your back walk away from this person because I'm telling you she is going to a psychic or she's going to someone um, to break you down and this person is not going to do it so be glad about that let's see what is going to be the outcomes for this week oh, yeah the outcomes for this week is that it's not gonna happen it's it's not gonna happen okay um, because whoever this person is whoever this person is they have your back in this situation whoever this person is this person see what is playing out and they really really have your back in this situation and this is going to be okay all right and um, for some of you who are looking for work or a promotion is going to be happening for some of you some of you who are looking for work there's going to be work and there's going to be a promotion that is going to be happening for you guys and um, yes 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 um, yes victory um, yes it's gonna happen for you so this is um, very very positive yes 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 this is going to be um, extremely positive 
as we're looking at this we're having the energy of the eye princess okay the eye princess is in the reverse form about um, this new beginning in work and it could be when the eye princess is in a reverse position that means it's not what they want you to have but yet still you need to have it you're gonna be good at it you're gonna be good at it it's it's as if they want you to do something else but what is coming and take it because you're going to be extremely extremely good at it okay let's look at the situation with this um, king of cups and the situation that is going on here because obviously there is a situation this king of cups is um he's actually um, looking at things and he's seeing things good because he's it's as if he realized that you know you and your partner whoever it is you and your partner um, you know is, is you know very good together but yet still it's as if um, be careful um, what is happening here because um, the energy of the love um, it's, it's as if this person really really cares about you and he's going to really protect you so you have to also honor this um, that is coming in okay you really need to honor this that is coming in so this is going to be good okay so um, let's um, see um, what is going on and what is um, transpiring okay so I'm using Archangel Michael I don't know why but my guides call me to use Archangel Michael so let's see what is coming out for you guys a sense of humor <laughs> I'm sorry but <laughs> this is what I was saying to you in the reading that whosoever the person is this Aquarian um, Leo or Sagittarius who is trying to fight against you and your relationship it can be your relationship or it could be your partner or you could your business thing or your business endeavor or whatsoever who's to ever this person is is a sense of humor because here she is and she's gonna pay some money to bring you down and it's not gonna happen because this person is thinking because who's to ever it says if she's going to a psychic or some spiritual person to bring you down and it's not gonna happen it's a sense of humor because this person is thinking you are the devil itself I'm leaving this couple to and, and these people so that they can have a good life so this is wonderful I'm, I'm I'm really loving this for you guys that um, a sense of humor come out I love this card especially when I'm using it and it says thank you for helping me see the humor in this situation so that I can um, lovingly laugh at human nature I am willing to view my experience in a new light in order um, to attract love and healing um, from this energy and here we go so kudos to you guys I'm so happy for you guys um, enjoy your week and don't let these people this person is just sick and um, please remember to listen to your Sun moon and rise and sign I want to thank each and every person for um, supporting my channel and to be here and I want to say to each and everyone um, have a wonderful wonderful um, positive week um, please remember to like share these videos namaste until next time